call race back in 2003. Okay, 2003. And it was a recall race with a lot of allegations of sexual groping against Arnold. He was running against a fellow named Gray Davis, who was Jerry Brown's former chief of staff. I have to know Gray Davis. I have to know Gray Davis. I have to rather like Gray Davis personally. Jerry Brown's chief of staff, I believe Gray was the lieutenant governor and then running for governor during this recall situation. Um, but I preferred Arnold, or so I thought. Arnold used to run around campaigning about he's a tax cutter and a supply fighter like Arthur Laffer. And Larry Kudlow, I'd invite him on the TV show. He'd never come on. But putting all that aside, here's the first point John McLaughlin said. He said, basically, Trump can't possibly defend each and every individual sexual allegation. He can't. There's not enough time. There's not enough evidence. And, of course, that would block out any issues discussion at all. So Mr. McLaughlin went back to the Schwarzenegger race where John was polling and was a strategist. And the issue was uh, similar to Trump. Schwarzenegger was accused of groping women, groping women or worse. Okay, now I'm in the mud here. I don't want to be in the mud, but I'm just telling you. It's a similar situation. And Mr. McLaughlin related to me. He'd be on today, but he had a prior commitment for some of his polling races. He said a lot of people were inclined to believe that Schwarzenegger had done some groping of women, that he was guilty. Okay? They believed that. On the other hand, they adopted a strategy out there. It was 2003, where Schwarzenegger basically held a news conference uh, with his wife, wife, Maria Shriver, and apologized. That okay, was a big press and he said, essentially, if I've offended anybody, we're sorry. We're sorry about that. Now, Mr. Trump did this, kind of, did this last week, and did it again at the debate. And then come all these new allegations this past week, which, in a sense, gets him back to square one, unfortunately. He never brought his wife, Melania, out to have a full-scale press conference and apologize uh, if I offended and any others out there. That's the way Schwarzenegger did it. This is 2003. It was, the, you get this, the Thursday before the Tuesday election. Now, I had forgotten this history. John McLaughlin is a brilliant guy who was involved in that race. Uh, reminded me. This is an interview last night. He said to me, go on ahead, put it out there uh, on the record. The Thursday before the race, Schwarzenegger had this news conference with his wife, Maria Shriver, and he apologized. Even though a lot of people figured he was a groping woman. Okay? Then, in the subsequent whatever, four or five days, Schwarzenegger got back to the issues of the state of California, which was going bankrupt. Spending issues, union issues, tax cut issues, economic growth issues. And